All right, in today's video, I wanna show you a quick little hack that I recently learned about how you can send a program feed from Ecamm Live to any TV in your building with an HDMI cable. Now, let's jump over to my computer and I'll show you how to do that in Ecamm. So all you have to do to get started is just make sure that Ecamm is your open application and you can do that by going to the top left hand corner of the screen and it'll say Ecamm Live and you go into preferences and stuff that way. However, I'm actually going to stay in this main screen. So you see all of these different toolbar options up here. So we're going to go over to the right to where it says output. We're going to click on that and then from there we need to get our video going. So let's go to video monitor and then go over to the secondary toolbar. And right now I don't have any other displays hooked up to this computer. So it just shows no display found. However, if I did have a splitter or another TV or monitor hooked up, it would show up right here with the name of the display. So like right now I have an LG Ultra HD uh, monitor. So it would say LG Ultra HD right here and you would just click on that and it would send video out or whatever the splitter name is, you get the picture. Now, since audio is just as important as the video, if not more, let's go down to audio monitor. So right here, it's defaulted to off. So what you would do is click on that exact same output. So you would do the TV or splitter, whatever the name is, same scenario, click on that, and that will send your audio automatically synced up and ready to go, and the same levels and everything as your broadcast that's going out to YouTube, Facebook, wherever you're taking it to. So I hope that that little demonstration helps you get a program feed set up in your nursery, your lobby, anywhere you want to take it to inside your church building. I just learned about this reading on a Facebook group and I wanted to check it out for myself. I have tested it here with multiple monitors right next to my computer so I know it works and I'm going to be implementing this ASAP at my church. So stick around, maybe you'll see something about that in the future. If you got anything out of this, please hit that like and subscribe button and I will catch you in the next one. Thanks.